And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Well, we're tracking snow showers on this late March day with temperatures way below normal. You can see the light snow uh, here across Fountain, southwestern Montgomery County. This is all working to the southeast. A little heavier snow shower action right here just south of Delphi. This heavy snow shower is headed for Rossville. And other snow showers in Tippecanoe County, a little heavier up towards Buck Creek. That's working southward towards Edna Mills and Pettit. And other scattered snow showers, Newton, Jasper County, around Monticello. Even a little bit of lake enhancement here north of Rensselaer towards Wheatfield. And other snow showers, Frankfort to Tipton. Now, these will slowly wane with time this evening. And we'll see the skies gradually clear tonight. That's going to set the stage for a near record cold night in the central and southwestern counties. But at least a dry, bright, but still pretty chilly Saturday, but we'll have less wind. Warmer Sunday, but windy, and a band of scattered showers will come through before it warms up nicely with some rainfall next week. Tonight, though, 20 degrees at 1 a.m. We're headed for 15 by 7 and 17 degrees at 5 a.m. Now, these are the record lows for early tomorrow morning. The record is 13, set in 1934 in the Lafayette area. Now in our north, we won't even be close to the record. That's four below zero set in 1934 at Rochester. The record is 13 at Petersburg, set in 1934 as well. And these are the forecasted lows, generally right around 15 area wide from 14 Burlington, 16 Kingman, 15 degrees at Otterburn. For Saturday, 35 to near 40 degrees, 41 Crawfordsville, 38 Lafayette, and about 39 at Dayton and Colfax and a little warmer Sunday. Just a lot of wind, 45 to 50 for the high, 48 Lafayette, 49 Frankfurt, and about 49 at Kirkland. Precision Future Cast shows the clouds dissipating with time tonight and early tomorrow morning. But notice tomorrow, it's a mostly sunny day. That's 10 o'clock tomorrow night, and really right through tomorrow night, mainly clear skies. And I think late tomorrow night, early Sunday morning, clouds will rapidly increase. We may drop into the 20s, then start to rise. And then this band of showers will come through Sunday afternoon, Sunday evening. This is 3, 4 o'clock in the afternoon and evening. And there the showers pull out of here, and we get some clearing on Sunday night. And Monday looks okay. It'll be a Pacific front, so it's actually going to be a little warmer behind it. 56 Monday, 66 Tuesday, 71 Wednesday. Couple showers, best chance of showers, couple thunder showers would be Wednesday night, early Thursday. 66 Thursday, and we're still in the 60s on Friday. It looks like after next Saturday, it will cool off again to highs in the 40s to right around 50 for a few days with overnights at or below freezing. So it's one of those very slow, cool springs we're getting into, but at least we've got a 71 on there. Yeah, we like that. Okay, thanks. Yes, sure. Well,